am I supposed to talk now? Celia, sorted. S O R D I D. I was Mila's roommate before someone fed her Milky Way with sodium cyanide, which is a tragedy that I know nothing about. I can't say I knew very much about her, really. We were roommates, sure, but before she messaged me for the first time, she'd never met me. And she messaged me through faceless chat on Craigslist, so I can imagine her surprise. You're not seeing this, right? You just... You're... Can I just... We often went our separate ways, never spoke unless necessary. Until that morning, that fateful morning, before everything changed, she was with, with me. me. I can't do this anymore. Do what, Mila? Oh, I know Mila didn't smoke. I just thought it would like add to the. Never mind. I can't do this anymore. Do what, Mila? Break bread with you, share my home, even have you in my starred pond house. It's too dangerous, do you understand? What are you saying? I'm saying that us living together is too dangerous. For me, for you, we have to break it off. I'd never forgive myself if something- Wait. Just accept it. Don't make this harder than it has to be. There are things that even you, my college roommate, don't know about me. Speak plainly, Mila. There are people after me. Dangerous people that... Uh, she didn't mention anyone specific. Mila had a lot of friends. Admirers. But she also had a lot of enemies. Jody Fitzgerald? I don't know her. Is she a friend? Or a suspect? Oh, the big announcement. Yes, I know about that. Shall I tell you? Celia, I have something very important to tell you. This might be the last you see of me for a while. I may... I may be going away for a bit. A away? Away? Yes, out of the city. But why? I cannot say. Not now. There are too many prying eyes about. But have patience. Soon you and most of my Instagram followers will hear what needs to be said. But I just wanted to say... I'll truly miss hearing your eclectic taste in music down the hall, and your porcelain dolls, of course. Especially Ava, she was my favorite. I don't know when we'll see each other again, so this might be goodbye. Forever. Also, will you come to my Halloween party tonight and bring alcohol as a gift? Yeah, yeah, of course, I I'd love to. Celia, are you listening? Yeah, yes, you said 8 p.m., right? I did. It's good to know that I have such an attentive ex-roommate as you. I believe she meant to make that announcement at the party, but she didn't get the chance to. At the party, I uh, mostly just kept to myself. I didn't speak to anyone of note. I didn't see her. She was surrounded by crowds of people, but not me, though. I didn't see her until... You're almost late. I'm sorry, okay? My Uber driver was too busy making polite conversations and actually driving. There's time to Just enough. You guys ready? Let's get this over with.